Namaste, Ma. How are your children? This is Praveen Sir, present Bharti. Today, this is the first chapter in the physics for SSC 2020-21. You guys are all after Corona batch. This is the chapter number one. The name of the chapter is Heat. I am pretty sure you all know about heat. Make under ki heat gurin chitels kadana na heat ante ante. Right now, e summer lo heat gurin chapan osan lege. Ate. హీట్ గురించి మీరు అలా తెలుసుకోవడం వేరు బట్ హీట్ యాజ్ అ ఫామ్ ఆఫ్ ఎనర్జీ తెలుసుకోవడం వేరు ఈ చాప్టర్లో మీరు హీట్ అనేది ఒక ఫామ్ ఆఫ్ ఎనర్జీ అండ్ హౌ కెన్ వీ మెషర్ ఇట్ హౌ కెన్ వీ ప్రొడ్యూస్ ఇట్ హౌ కెన్ వీ ట్రాన్స్ఫర్ ఇట్ ఇవన్నీ నేర్చుకుంటాం ఓకే దిస్ ఇస్ వాట్ యూ గోయింగ్ టు లర్న్ ఇన్ దిస్ చాప్టర్ యూ గోయింగ్ టు లర్న్ వాట్ ప్రొడ్యూసెస్ హీట్ హౌ కెన్ వీ ట్రాన్స్ఫర్ హీట్ ఎనర్జీ ఫ్రమ్ వన్ ఫామ్ టు అనదర్ ఫామ్ హౌ డూ వీ మెషర్ హీట్ and there are several activities that will give you a broader understanding regarding heat okay now in this chapter primarily we are going to cover heat heat energy thermal equilibrium temperature specific heat in this session let's move to the next slide why learn about heat why do we want to learn about heat because heat is the most fundamental form of energy where do we get energy from we get energy from sun sun gives energy in the in two forms light energy and heat energy the heat energy is one of the most fundamental forms of energy the other fundamental form is light so manaki suryan nunchi vache tivanti prathamika shakti swarupalalo ushnam kuda okati heat kuda okati heat gives energy for all life forms that exist in nature yes or no manaki nature lo unna prathi jeevi ki heat anedi shakti nistundi you will understand a little bit more but for now keep in mind that for every life form heat is one of the most fundamental forms of energy and the game of heat gurinchi nechukuntunam next heat is emitted in all forms of energy transfer and conversion okay this is another important point you need to keep in mind heat anedi ipudu let me give you a very simple example you sit on your bike you start the bike and you start driving the bike amazingly the engine gets heated up right the bike is converting the chemical energy in the petrol into kinetic energy for you to move but chemical energy kinetic energy ga mare tappudu maddhalo engine lo nunchi heat chinda leda in the similar way when you turn on the fan and you touch the fan it will be hot turn on the tv touch the back of the tv it will be hot tv converts electrical energy to light energy and heat energy light energy and sound energy i'm sorry but when you touch the tv it is hot in the back so what i'm trying to say here is heat energy is emitted in all forms of energy conversions id inga meek artham avutundi pon pon prasthanik mind lo pettukondi mudodi nalugodi conservation of heat energy will be most important job of an engineer scientist technician and everyone heat energy gurinchi mana enduku enta baga nechukuntam why do we learn about heat it is because as an engineer as a technician as a scientist one of our major goals is not to waste heat energy during energy conversion heat energy chaala waste ayipothu untundi danni evaraithe takku cheyagalaro aa wastage ni they are going to be very rich look what i wrote reducing heat loss will make us rich and efficient so these are some of the reasons why we learn about heat other than the reason heat chapter uh, you probably will get for about 6 marks in the final examination so you have to learn about it let's move to the next slide what will we learn in this chapter each chapter lo manu em nechukuntam we will understand how heat flows or moves or transfers okay heat is a form of energy like every form of energy heat will move from one form to another form or one point to another point how does heat move idi nechukuntam e vidhanga ushnam oka chotu nunchi inko chotu kadultundi move avutundi dani gurinchi nechukuntam number 2 we will also study how to measure heat as an energy heat is a form of energy we know that now how do we measure it what is the purpose of measuring we all measure everything and to day to day lives we measure so many things why do we measure we measure to compare we measure to compare example ni height kolchukuntam kolchukoni em chestam unless you measure the height of your friend you don't enjoy now evadu poduga unnadu evadu pottiga unnadu measurement anedi endukante compare cheyadaniki mind lo pettukondi next we will study how heat energy is produced e vidhanga heat energy produce ayindi deeni kuda study chestam ee chapter lo we will study the concept of temperature and the logic behind temperature scales this is another important topic 
we will study temperature. Temperature is associated with heat but in a different manner. And what are the various temperature scales and what is the logic behind it. Next, we will also measure heat energy absorbed and released by a body based on its mass and physical nature. All right. This is another important. We will also measure the heat energy absorbed and released by a body based on its mass and physical nature. And then, okay, what's the one thing? A what's the one thing? Yeah, we then got heat energy in a job. Yeah, we then got heat energy in the release chest on the. And then, I'm studying just them. And then, then we had other part of the good image. At the most of them, next go to the next slide. First, heat flows, heat transfers, heat moves. Okay. Heat and heavy. Prava his to the. ఒక చోటు నుంచి ఇంకో చోటుకి వెళ్తుంది తన అంతర తాను కదులుతుంది అలైట్ కీప్ ఇన్ మైండ్ హీట్ ఫ్లోస్ హీట్ ట్రాన్స్ఫర్స్ హీట్ మూవ్స్ నా హీట్ ఈజ్ ఎ ఫామ్ ఆఫ్ ఎనర్జీ దట్ ఫ్లోస్ ఫ్రమ్ మై ఫ్రమ్ బాడీస్ విత్ హయ్యర్ హీట్ ఎనర్జీ టు బాడీస్ విత్ లోవర్ హీట్ ఎనర్జీ ఓకే అక్కడ చిన్న మిస్టేక్ పడింది అమ్మ స్లైడ్లో ఫ్రమ్ ఏ బాడీ అనుకుంటాను దట్ ఐ విల్ కరెక్ట్ ఇట్ లేర్ హీట్ ఈజ్ ఎ ఫామ్ ఆఫ్ ఎనర్జీ దట్ ఫ్లోస్ ఫ్రమ్ ఏ బాడీస్ విత్ హయ్యర్ హీట్ ఎనర్జీ టు బాడీస్ విత్ లోయర్ హీట్ ఎనర్జీ ఓకే let us take two bodies okay for example let us take ice and boiling water okay now what which body has um, higher uh, higher heat energy the boiling water has higher heat energy and ice has lower heat energy yes now in nature the heat from the boiling water will be transferred to the ice from ice for ice with the lower heat energy okay good in much simpler terms heat flows from hotter bodies to colder bodies vedika unna bodies nunchi challaga unna bodies ki heat velthu okay good now another point hot and cold are comparative terms hot ga unda cold ga unda anevi comparative terms ante for example ice undi water undi adhe vidhanga boiling water undi boiling water tho compare chesthe normal water la untundi cold ga untundi right when you compare normal water with boiling water obviously no, normal water is colder than the boiling water right now if you compare the same normal water with ice this is warmer or this is hotter so now you understand that hot ante vedi ga untundan kadu inko danta compare chestina appudu vedi ga untundi cold ante challa ga undani kadu inko danta compare chestina appudu challa ga undi now let's go back into this slide one more time and understand what what's going on heat flows heat transfers heat moves now the point is how does heat move heat always moves from a body at higher temperature to a body at lower temperature or heat moves from bodies with higher heat energy to bodies with lower heat energy classic example heat will move from wa- from boiling water to ice okay good now i have two questions for you the first question is what is the coldest thing known to man మనిషికి తెలిసినటువంటి అత్యంత చల్లనైనటువంటి వస్తువు ఏది ఆలోచించి ఆన్సర్ చెప్పాలి వాట్ ఈస్ ద హార్టెస్ట్ థింగ్ నోన్ టు మ్యాన్ ఐ థింక్ యూ ఆల్ నో ది ఆన్సర్ ఫర్ దిస్ బట్ ఐమ్ గోయింగ్ టు గివ్ ఇట్ యూ లెట్స్ మూవ్ టు ద నెక్స్ట్ స్లైడ్ హౌ టు మెషర్ హీట్ యాజ్ అ ఫామ్ ఆఫ్ ఎనర్జీ హీట్ని ఎలా కొలుస్తాం ఎందుకు కొలుస్తామో మనం ఆల్రెడీ మాట్లాడుకున్నాం వీ హ్యావ్ ఆల్రెడీ డిస్కస్ వై వీ మెజర్ ఎనీథింగ్ వీ మెజర్ ఎనీథింగ్ టు కంపేర్ విత్ సంథింగ్ ఎల్స్ రైట్ ఇఫ్ యూ మెజర్ యువర్ హైట్ యూఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు కంపేర్ విత్ యువర్ ఫ్రెండ్స్ if you measure your weight you are going to compare it with somebody else right for example you compare with your friend and you say oh my god you are so fat i am okay if you measure if you and the same thing sometimes you feel oh my god i'm 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 underweight i want to put some muscle and so anyways my point is you measure to compare okay now before moving further we need to work on a topic called energy what is energy energy is the capacity to do work all right energy is the capacity to do work let us get a very clear understanding right now before we move further good now what is meant by capacity to do work okay now let us go into a dark room and try to see can you see chudagalra chudadam ane pani cheyagalra oka cheekati ga unnatuvanti gadilo e maatram veluturu lenatuvanti gadilo kaanti lenatuvanti gadilo chudadam ane pani cheyagalra చేయలేం కదా యూ కెనాట్ అది ఎప్పుడు సాధ్యపడుతుంది ఓన్లీ వెన్ యూ హ్యావ్ లైట్ రైట్ నా ఇఫ్ సంబడి టర్న్స్ ద లైట్ ఆన్ ఇన్ ద రూమ్ ఇమీడియట్లీ యూ విల్ బీ ఏబుల్ టు సీ యూ గెట్ ది కెపాసిటీ ఆఫ్ విజన్ చూడడం అనేటువంటి పని నువ్వు ఎప్పుడు చేయగలవు వెన్ యూ హ్యావ్ సంథింగ్ కాల్డ్ లైట్ ఎనర్జీ 
ఇప్పుడు అర్థమైందా ఏంటో లైట్ ఎనర్జీ మీకు ఏ కెపాసిటీ ఇస్తుంది చూడడం అనే పని చేసే కెపాసిటీ ఎవరు ఇస్తున్నారో లైట్ ఎనర్జీ అర్థమైందా సో ఎనర్జీ గివ్స్ యూ ది కెపాసిటీ టు డూ వర్క్ సిమిలర్లీ నువ్వు చెవులు మూసుకున్నావు అనుకో బయట శబ్దాలు వినిపిస్తాయా వినపడవు ఎందుకు వినపడవు ఎందుకంటే నీ చెవులు పని చేయాలంటే నీకు ఏం కావాలి శబ్దం కావాలి రైట్ ఫర్ యువర్ ఇయర్స్ టు ఫంక్షన్ ఫర్ యువర్ యూఎస్ టు వర్క్ యూ నీడ్ సౌండ్ ఎనర్జీ వితౌట్ సౌండ్ ఎనర్జీ can you hear no that's good right so now let us recap the slide one more time for us to do any kind of work we need energy any doubts good now how do we measure energy how do measure cheyadam ante enti kolavadam avun paduvun dentlo kulustamu centimeters lo kulustamu meters lo kulustam baruvun dentlo kulustamu kg lo kulustamu gram lo kulustam you all know this right yes or no good now similarly how do you measure energy energy and the energy is the capacity to do work so how do we measure energy energy is measured in joules joules ka do joules ka do joules remember the term joules energy is measured in joules and calories so why two units i will explain now oka pudu way back in i think it's in 14th or 13th century they used the term calorie and in the recent 20th century the international systems of units have adapted joules as the unit for energy okay so energy in any in any vidhaga kulustam amma rendu vidhalaga kulustam okate mo calories inkokate mo joules now there is a relationship between a calorie and a joule okay one calorie is equals to 4.18 or 4.2 joule okay let's go back and understand this slide one more time how to measure heat as a form of energy before going further energy is the capacity to to do work look at the table for seeing or vision you need light energy for listening or audibility you need sound energy yeah see the table right right here this is the table i am talking about good now energy is measured in calories and joules the most popular unit is joule this is adapted in the 20th century this is a older unit there is a relationship between a calorie and a joule one calorie is equals to 4.18 joule or 4.2 joule any doubts all right if you have doubts you can call me and i can answer your questions all right good let's go to the next slide now this is the important slide this is my slide this is not in the textbook i have added this it is confusing to measure different energies using the same unit avuna kada energy annam sound energy undi light energy undi kinetic energy undi nuclear energy undi wind energy in energies ki okate unit koncham confusion if i say i have 10 joules of energy you would not know whether it is light energy or heat energy or sound energy whatever energy it is so and energy and it is a bit the broader term it and it it bring it is like a big umbrella under which all various forms of energies are there right energy is a big pedda padam manushulu ento pedda padam rakrakal telatolu nalatolu rakrakal vallu untaru kada energy kuda alanti padame aitike ikka chudandi using joule for measuring energy is fine baane undi energy measure cheyadan joule vaartam but measuring sound energy light energy heat energy kinetic energy potential energy nuclear energy electric energy in joules can be utterly confusing kada in energies ni otti joules ra measure cheyalante confusing ga untunda untada yes andukani scientists have given us a little bit more flexibility instead of simply measuring energy scientists ask uh, scientists have created our scientists have developed something called as intensities of energy teevrata enda undi vediga undi enta teevranga undi ani important so scientists have created something called intensity of energy for example intensity of sound is measured in decibels light intensity in candela heat in, heat intensity in temperature electrical energy in wattage electrical intensity in wattage ardhamaindamma so even though we have a single unit for measuring energy that is joules we have dedicated intensity measuring system for sound light heat electrical energy etc okay this is my slide don't worry about this all right so i want to wrap it up here i want to see how you receive this and you will have a small assessment test following this do the assessment test uh, please pass any comments that you think what about the sound what about the presentation is the slide okay all these co- comments are welcome parents please take a minute and do this all right thank you and i'm going to wrap up the first class thank you